In tonight's Consumer Alert, it turned out to be a bit of a dog day afternoon for Amazon during its much-hyped Prime Day. Some bargain-seeking shoppers encountered glitches with the company's website. They were met with apology messages accompanied by various photos of dogs. The message read, uh-oh, something went wrong on our end. And that led many people to hit social media to complain about not being able to take advantage of the deals, many of which were time sensitive. The company spokesperson said many are shopping successfully and that the number of items ordered in the first hour of Prime Day surpassed the numbers from the first hour last year. Prime Day began its 36-hour run at 2 p.m. and is exclusive to Amazon shoppers with Prime memberships. When it comes to relocating for a new job, company culture is more of a lure than a $10,000 bump in pay. A new survey from a company rating website also says younger workers more inclined to relocate. Men are more likely to, uh, than women to change cities for a new job. Plus, the more education an employee has, the more likely they are willing to switch locales. Kids clothing retailer Jimbury is launching a reboot. It happened today. A new website and a new app augmented the realty, uh, realty uh, features of the part of that uh, chain's e-commerce push, along with a refresh of its brick-and-mortar stores. The move comes a little more than a year after the chain filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy and closed 360 stores during its restructuring. The company's CEO told CNBC it's an all-new Jimboree, different in almost every single way. Red Hawks in South Dakota. Red Hawks are in South Dakota, but I was really, really having fun in the sports office tonight watching the Home Run Derby. We'll tell you all about that, and we'll get you those Red Hawks highlights as well. That's all next in sports.